In this video, I'm going to tell you why Kartra is the absolute best click funnels alternative. So we're going over everything. We're going to look at a high level overview, what they both are, where they're basically a tie, where click funnels wins, where Kartra wins. We're going to look at pricing and look at the value both of them provide. And then finally, I'm going to give you my recommendations on which one you should choose. Hi everyone, it's Kevin from Solopreneur and I help serious entrepreneurs start and grow online businesses. I'm really excited for this video. It is the showdown of the two best funnel building or marketing automation software. It is a competition between Kartra and ClickFunnels. And if you're looking for an alternative to ClickFunnels for whatever reason, if you're considering the software, or maybe you're, if you're thinking, hey, what else is out there in the market? I'm going to explain to you why Kartra is the absolute best alternative. And then we're gonna go over everything by the end of this video you'll be able to make a decision for which one is right for you. So let's jump right into it. So firstly, what is ClickFunnels and what is Kartra? So ClickFunnels is, as you probably know, just marketing and sales funnel automation software. So ClickFunnels helps you make these sales and marketing funnels that guide your user through the buyer's journey. So you can try and get them at a prospect level, you know, when they're just a visitor and how do you not only get them to be a buyer, but how do you extract the most amount of money out of this person through cross sales and upsells and all of this great stuff. And ClickFunnels builds these funnels for you or guides you through these funnels on how to build these flows. You've undoubtedly in your life been placed into one of these nurturing campaigns, whether it's through ClickFunnels or some other software, but this is exactly what it does. Now, Kartra has that exact same functionality as ClickFunnels, except it also provides various operational additional features. So it helps you with various other operations and it does a lot of other things that ClickFunnels doesn't do. And we're going to get into all of that. Firstly, where are they even? So in other words, where could you say that ClickFunnels and Kartra, comparably, they do more or less the same thing? Now, I'm not splitting hairs. There are little pieces here and there that each of them do better, but for all intents and purposes, these are the areas where it's basically a toss, right? There may be specific situations to you where one is slightly better than the other, but for the most part, they're almost dead even. So the first and probably one of the most important parts of getting software like this is the pre-built templates. And I can tell you they're more or less comparable. Like, let's just take a look at that right now. So here we are in Kartra. You can see the breadth of templates. You can see here all kinds for basically any use case you would like. And you can even just go to show more and you can see that just like that in ClickFunnels, you can see here it's basically the same thing. There are ones that are slightly different in each of them, but for the most part, there are the same kinds of funnels. Now, there are a couple of other funnels with Kartra uh, that ClickFunnels doesn't have because Kartra has more functionality in it, so it just wouldn't make sense for ClickFunnels to have in there. But other than that, it's b basically the exact same Thing. And ClickFunnels also has, in a sense, two areas for the campaigns because they actually have the follow-up funnels, which is not included in the basic model. So you can go in here and you can create a new follow-up funnel. And one of the things I don't like, though, is that it's not integrated as to when you need to do these follow-up funnels. So while in Kartra, because everything is included, it's actually pre-built for you from the start. So you actually get the emails in that sequence automatically. Whereas in ClickFunnels, because the emails are optional, they've actually separated out the funnel builder into if you have the email component and if you don't. So there is a diagram when you go in here, which kind of tells you what to do. Like if we uh, select this in here, I'll show you what I mean by the uh, email part being built into the funnels and not. So um, let's say you go through here, you can actually download the funnel map, something I like. And of course you can watch the video and then it tells you follow up funnels, but that's it. It just tells you follow up funnels and you're supposed to figure out how to build these follow up funnels or try and I guess learn from the resources. As opposed to Kartra, when you look at something like this, 
uh, you can see here that it's actually including the emails in the sequences right here. So I'll show you, like if you go, this is the one I'm just showing you guys how to do this really quickly. You can see if you go to sequences, so you can see that it's all built in and already tagged for you and the email is already built. So that's the one difference there that because Kartra has the emails included in all plans, it's all part of the funnel importer. But other than that, they both work the same way. Like if you click on something, then you just go get funnel and it starts building it. And then as you can see here, you kind of, I will, for the interest of time, I won't go through everything, but it kind of just walks you through the checklist of what you're supposed to build. And likewise in Kartra, when you hit the deploy button here, then it creates this little thing on the side. And just like ClickFunnels, you kind of just go through the process of editing each of these things. So I would say that Kartra's is slightly better because they do include the emails in all the campaigns. And with ClickFunnels, you're sort of left to figure that part out on your own. But for the most part, um, you know, they're comparable. The next part is the drag and drop page builders. So a big part of Kartra and ClickFunnels is not having to code anything with any of their page builders. So I'm just gonna go in here and show you guys how that all works. So let's just pick something. Let's edit a Kartra page. And likewise, at the same time, let's uh, edit a ClickFunnels page. So here we are in the ClickFunnels editor and as you can expect, you can just click on anything and edit it right away. Everything is drag and drop, super easy to edit. You can configure things just like many other page builders you've seen. You can go and you can add sections. Let's say you wanna add some different content. You can go in here and just simply drag it in. And just like that, Kartra is the exact same thing. Everything is just you click and you edit it. If you wanna add new sections, you can do that, you can find hero sections, whatever. There's a lot of great designs and you can just drag it in. Now, there are pieces and bits that they do better than each other, but for all intents and purposes, there you're gonna see about 90% of the same. So I don't think it's worth discussing which is marginally better than the other. Personally, I find that Kartra has a little more templates, but again, this is just a wash in terms of which is really better here. And finally, where I think they're pretty comparable is basic analytics. You can see that right within each of these funnels you have analytics so you can see for each of the assets in there you can see what the analytics are and likewise Kartra has analytics for every single thing built in as well now personally Kartra's I like a little bit more just because it's visual but from a data perspective it's the exact same thing so you can see here you can actually see which on Kartra you can see which devices but ClickFunnels doesn't seem to be there, but actually you just simply have to hit filter and then you just have to change it here. So visually looks a little nicer on Kartra, but again, completely a wash, right? I mean, that stuff doesn't matter what it looks like visually. So where does ClickFunnels win? Let's look at that first and then we'll talk about where Kartra wins. So the first place that ClickFunnels wins is its Funnel Fix Academy or learning site. So here we are in the Funnel Flix portal and what this is is just, I'm not gonna go through everything, but just so much content on improving your understanding of funnels and your professional development and business strategy, personal development, product course, traffic, copywriting, funnel building, like each of these are courses that you can just click into and then learn more about, right? So um, let's just go into this one as an example. And as you can see in here, it is a, some pretty in-depth lessons about this and you know everything has videos and whatnot so this is a great resource from click funnels to help you understand funnels now kartra also has a training program but it's nowhere on the level like you can see here it's pretty good you know in terms of it has videos for everything and um let's say you want to learn about let's just pick something right let's say you want to learn about building simple lists or something right and you know it has some stuff here it has a lot of videos in a lot of different things and you know for all the different campaigns and whatnot but it's not quite as in depth and engaging as the click funnels one so i'd just say that overall click funnels has Kartra beat there uh, and the other thing that click funnels has that Kartra doesn't have are the webinar funnels so if i actually go in here 
and you can do create a new funnel as an example, uh, host a webinar. So it has more of an integrated webinar funnel system. You can do live and uh, pre-recorded webinars. Now the webinar software isn't included, but it kind of integrates with webinar software and they just have a webinar funnel that you can use. And Kartra at this time of this recording does not have any sort of webinar funnels. Now it does integrate with Webinar Jam, which is their sister company. So you can make webinar funnels, but they're just not out of the box. Okay, moving on. So community. So ClickFunnels is the older and more popular product and it has a bigger community. That's just a fact. So if you're looking for more resources and information and people making YouTube videos and all that good stuff, you're going to get more with ClickFunnels. Also, ClickFunnels is marginally easier to use, but that's only because it does less stuff than Kartra. So common sense dictates if there's something that can do three things and something that can do six things, obviously it's easier to learn the thing, the only the three things rather than having to learn all six. So for the tools that they both share, it's not any easier. It's about the same. And both tools are pretty, I'll be honest with you, both tools have a, have a decent learning curve, right? These are not um, just simple programs. These are extremely advanced programs. They guide you through everything with these one-click campaigns, but they take a little bit of time. But all things being equal, because ClickFunnels does less then it's slightly easier than Kartra. That's the only reason. And lastly, I guess ClickFunnels is a better name than Kartra. Kartra is kind of a dumb name, but <laughs> I mean, obviously I'm kidding here. It doesn't really matter, but yeah, if, if we were going to give them some points for something then uh, extra, then <laughs> I guess it's a better name than Kartra. But what about Kartra? Where does it win? I mean, Kartra has a lot going for it that ClickFunnels doesn't do. I'm not even just going to sugarcoat it. So firstly, Kartra has a built-in help desk, right? So it has built-in help desk software, as you can see here, right? So you can assign tickets, can responses, frequently, everything in here. It also has a calendar. You can start uh, setting appointments. You can do notifications, reminders. You can see all of this stuff. It's all in one dashboard. So when you're dealing with your clients, this is great if you're like doing coaching as well, right? Or if you have paid appointments and whatnot or per paid services, say your personal trainer, simple example, right? And you're doing some web coaching or something. You can see that. So right off the bat, those two features, not in uh, ClickFunnels at all. One of my favorite components of Kartra is the video. So Kartra can host video. ClickFunnels can't, but it's not just like a little YouTube video or something like that. It's brandable. And most importantly, it has lead capture mechanisms. So you guys can see here, I've added a call to action and you can actually get a link here and then you can link out to something, but that's not all. Like you can, you guys can see here, you can actually have an opt-in form, an image banner, a caption, caption plus button. You can make it so that they have to do a social action before they can access the video. I mean, the video functionality is amazing. It's on par with something like Vistia, which is a hundred dollars a month. So video is crazy. Um, and of course the video integrates with all the other features. So, and I'm going to talk more about that. Another super cool thing is Kartra has heat maps built in. So you can see where people are engaging with your page, which content, how far they get on the page, all of that. So you can see that time on page, all of these advanced analytics, ClickFunnels does not have that. You'd need something like crazy egg or hot jar typically to do something like this. The next thing Kartra has is behavioral adaptive marketing, personalization, and lead scoring. These are features typically found in enterprise level marketing automation software like HubSpot, Marketo, Pardot. So I'll show you guys what that exactly means. So you can see here, let's say I'm going to mute this, right? Just as a simple example for you guys. I'm going to mute this. So you can see here, if you have someone with these dynamic tags, so someone's purchased a product, they have the gold membership and they've done the, they have, and they've done this other action. You can start firstly giving them points for each of these actions. So you can do lead scoring it's called. And then if someone triggers a certain lead score, then you can actually start serving them exclusive coupons. So personalization. So it is crazy. The amount of dynamic customization you can do. And because you have all of this data in one place with Kartra, right? You know, if someone watches a video, you can give them points. If they did open an email, you can give them points. If they clicked on a landing page, if they bought a product. So the customization level is insane. And like I said, you'd have to purchase something like HubSpot to get something comparable to this. And HubSpot at the enterprise level is like 30 grand a year. So just keep that in mind. So all of this right here, 
ClickFunnels doesn't have anything close to this. Then also vastly superior email automation. Okay, so looking at the email automation in ClickFunnels, you can see here, as always, you have to have your triggers, right? So you can have, you know, what, did they take a social action? Did they do contact? Did they do a funnel? So there's some stuff here that you can trigger off of. And it's pretty decent, to be honest, it's pretty decent. But looking at the Kartra version, it's just head and shoulders above, right? There's dynamic tagging. You can have it based on lists. You can have it based on someone who ordered something, visited a page, sequences, like, and everything is sort of just drag and drop. You can just click things and uh, like drag which step happens in the next step. So without going into all the intricate details, Kartra's is just more advanced, period. I mean, I won't say that. ClickFunnels' version is garbage by any means or anything like that. It's just Kartra's is more advanced. And also because you can do certain things, like you can have tags in any of these features. So like I said, if you want someone to be served an email because they've watched half a video, you can do that because that functionality is all in one place. So ClickFunnels obviously can't do that because they don't have video. So the Kartra email automation is superior. And likewise, even the membership sites. So within Kartra, the membership portals, you actually get progress tracking, you get badges, and of course you have videos built in and ClickFunnels doesn't. So obviously if you're making an online course these days, you need videos. Like if you're making courses without videos, no one's subscribing to your courses. I can almost promise you that, right? So it's almost an expectation. So obviously with Kartra, that's all built in. Whereas with ClickFunnels, you'd have to get Vimeo or maybe you're like doing unlisted on YouTube or something like that, right? So moving on, Kartra also has better advanced analytics and that's only because there are more things, right? So when you're looking at a contact, you can see what videos they've watched, you've seen how many help desk tickets they've submitted, you've seen how many pages they viewed, all of these things. So everything's just a little bit more integrated and granular, whereas ClickFunnels, that information would be hosted in another tool. Say you were using like Zendesk or something with ClickFunnels, then that would be in Zendesk, right? It wouldn't be in one place. And you obviously couldn't make any automations out of that. Now, maybe you can do it with a custom API integration. Maybe you use Zapier and you pay for that, or maybe you they have an out of the box integration or something like that, maybe. But again, it is not as seamless and you're dealing with technical headaches and you really don't want that. <laughs> and lastly, I almost included this one as a joke, but uh, Kartra technically has blogging and ClickFunnels doesn't. But I, you know, I wouldn't let Kartra brag about it too much because the blogging is not great. And so technically this is a blog post and you can do all the same stuff as the page builder. You can you know do all of this great stuff, except the content's not dynamic, right? It's not really a content management system. So we can't dynamically update this content like if you actually had a content management system, like it doesn't know what your most recent posts are. You're manually entering this. So yes, Kartra does have blogs and I guess that's additional value that you you know you could use if you wanted to and it has all kinds of blog templates but i can't say that it's particularly good so i would say kartra's blogging uh <laughs> i'd say score would be 50 percent out of say a total of like 100 and i guess since click funnels is zero i guess kartra's is better but i would say that if you're serious about blogging i'd probably get something like wordpress and that's probably the only other software you need to complement kartra but Yes, so technically it has blogs, but not really something to brag about. Okay, so now let's talk about pricing. So taking a look at both plans, here's what the truth is. So Kartra, it is way better for entry-level pricing and functionality and it has an annual discount plans. Let me show you what I mean. With Kartra, all of the features are included in every single plan, including the $99 plan. The only feature that's excluded is the agency functionality, which starts at $199. And all that means is that if you want to create Kartra accounts for people you manage, like let's say you're running an agency and you want Kartra accounts for your customers, then that's 199. And I assume there's a percentage of people who do that, but for most people who are just running their own business, that functionality has no no bearing on their decision. So Kartra, you get for $99 a month, you get all of the features, including email automation. ClickFunnels for $97, you don't get email automation. That starts at $297 a month. On top of that, Kartra also provides 25% discounts if you do an annual plan. ClickFunnels does not include that. There are no annual discounts. So 
for seventy nine dollars a month if you paid annually versus two ninety seven. Like because to be honest with you, ClickFunnels is unusable without the emails. It's just idiotic. I guess you could use your own email provider. Right, you can use a third party integration. I mean, that's possible, but it's just not a great solution. A big part of that funnel is email. And so I would not recommend this plan. I don't know who would use this. Now, where ClickFunnels shines a little bit is that if you notice with Kartra, once we get to the same price as ClickFunnels right here, the 299, you only have up to 25,000 leads. Whereas ClickFunnels has unlimited leads. So that kind of means like if your business has more than 25,000 contacts, maybe ClickFunnels could be cheaper for you, right? And now then there's other little things, right? Like the number of users. Kartra gives you unlimited users, but ClickFunnels is limited. But ClickFunnels gives you more domains than Kartra, blah, blah, blah. But the main item here is the number of contacts or leads. And yes, ClickFunnels gives you an unlimited amount. So if your business has more than 25,000 contacts, then... Click funnels could be cheaper in that sense. Only if you don't need any of the other functionality. Because if you add in the other functionality, then maybe click funnels could be more. So Kartra does have one other plan, which is uh, $4.99 a month. Um, right there, it's up to 50,000 leads. And ClickFunnels also has another plan, but clearly you're not thinking about this plan if you're watching this video, because obviously this plan is for someone who's used ClickFunnels for a long time and built their entire business in ClickFunnels. So I won't even talk about it because clearly this video wouldn't be for you. Uh, so yes, so you can see Karcho, once you get to 50,000 leads, it does go up to 499 a month. So that is the one situation where, you know, ClickFunnels may have better pricing if your business does high volume with many contacts and there's over 25 contacts. So who is the overall winner? I got to be honest, it's hard for me to recommend ClickFunnels over Kartra. Kartra wins hands down in practically every situation. I'd only possibly recommend ClickFunnels over Kartra if, like I said, you have more than 25 leads and really don't care about any of the additional functionality and or you're willing to pay for the additional services for whatever reason. Again, at that point, you know, does that make sense? It Maybe if you have like 40,000 or 50,000, maybe it won't make sense, but maybe if you have like, I don't know, like 400,000 contacts, then maybe ClickFunnels is better. But at that point, I guess you could contact Kartra for an enterprise plan and who knows how much that would be. I would also recommend ClickFunnels only if you really want the funnel education. And another part of that is ClickFunnels also has a pretty cool community. They have like events they do and this whole like get togethers. Of course, with COVID, it's very different in 2020, but they have this community you can be a part of. And so for people who find that uh, interesting and who want to take part in that educational experience, that is something cool you do get with ClickFunnels that you don't necessarily get as much with Kartra. But other than those two, what I would consider somewhat exceptional cases that not everyone would fall into, there really is no reason to get ClickFunnels over Kartra. I mean, especially if you're starting out and you don't need unlimited contacts, at that point, there is absolutely no reasons to pay three times as much to get less functionality. And the last thing I'll say is I did say that ClickFunnels does have better webinar integration, but like I said, Kartra does integrate with their sister uh, platform, Webinar Jam. So you can do everything you can do in ClickFunnels. It's just not done for you in a one-click campaign as of right now. So there's that one little thing. If webinars, for whatever reason, are a huge part of your business and you know uh, you don't know how to do the strategy behind that, then maybe uh, something like ClickFunnels, maybe at that point you could consider it as well. So that's my recommendation. I really think Kartra is the better solution for the vast majority of people. But what I would recommend before you make a decision is to really do the trial for both products. Now, when it comes to Kartra, you can see here it's $1.99 a month and $99 a month. But if you click my affiliate link, I can actually give you a 14-day trial for $1. So click the link and you'll be taken here and you can see now it says start trial. And then you'll be taken to the same pricing page, except now you'll see that you have a trial. You have a 14-day trial for $1. But don't click that yet. I'm going to show you guys right now how to get a 30-day trial which is extremely beneficial when you're trying a product like Kartra that does have a lot of stuff in it. So what you want to do is you just want to kind of scroll around, give it about 30 seconds, and you want to maybe expand some of these and not just like scroll around a little bit and just do not click this button yet. Just wait about 20, 30 seconds. Then what you want to periodically and slowly do is just navigate to the back button 
And then if you've done that correctly, you'll get this exit intent pop up. And then you can click double my trial. And then you can see you can get 30 days for $1. Now you'll notice that it's the 199 plan. So maybe you need, you just want to do the starter or maybe you need the platinum and you need 50,000 leads and you're like, this doesn't work for me. But just know that you can go through this entire thing and then change your plan immediately after. But in order to get the 30 days, you just have to go through the silver package, which is like the middle package. So just go, go in and downgrade if you need to or upgrade if you need to and then you'll be able to be on the right plan and that you can test. But in terms of actually testing the product, all the functions are the same. So it's not like you need to pick one because you need access to this feature, right? So that's one of the great things, as I mentioned about Kartra. In regards to ClickFunnels, I'll leave a link in the description as well for how you guys can get started with that. So that's it, guys. Hopefully I've helped you make a decision on which marketing automation or funnel building software is right for you. I have a ton of other videos on funnels and Kartra and I encourage you to check the channel out and see those. There'll be a couple of videos linked in the description as well. Like the video and, and subscribe to the channel if you want more great content. I'd love to also hear what other alternatives you guys are considering. I mean, these aren't obviously the only two out there. There's Kajabi, there's Builderall, there's so many different ones. So I'd love to hear your comments on whether you've tried one and you switched to another and whatnot. And so love to hear that sound off in the comments and we'll see you guys in the next one. Take care.